insanely cheap FIFA coins, go to Foot Flash. They have FIFA points. They have coins on both consoles. And use the discount code QKN for 5% off. Link in the description. What is going on guys? It is me Quinkin and welcome back to a brand new video. Today we're going to have a end of season report for the Phoenix career mode. We're going to be going through everything. We're going to be going through a squad report. We're going to be going through the top scores, the top assisters, and the top clean cheaters in the league. We're also going to take a look at who got relegated and who made it onto the next division. That's going to be freaking awesome. And if you guys do go on to enjoy today's video, slap a like, leave a comment down below, and subscribe. I do need help of players to get next season on my team, so go ahead and leave a comment down below. But the first thing we're going to do is that we are going to give all of our wages, all of our money uh, to a player that we're going to sell next season. That way when we sell him, we get the money back. So the player we are going to choose is Gerardo Bruna. Uh, he's not going to stay on our club. I am going to look to get a new winger and he hasn't had a lot of play time. So we're going to look for him and then we're going to offer him a new contract. So here he is right here. He is getting a lot of money, 5000 a week. So getting rid of him would be very helpful. So we, what we are going to do is we're going to offer him a contract that he's not going to want to reject. So we're going to give him all of our money, which is $46,000. We're going to give him crucial first team player and we're going to sign him for one more year. That's what we want. So that is what we're going to do. And then hopefully he does accept that contract. Now we do get the manager award because we were the best manager in the league. So that's freaking awesome. We won the league. We got to the semis of the FA Cup and the final of the J Payne Trophy. So I do believe that we do deserve this. This award now this is how the league ended up if you guys didn't see the last episode we got first place with 102 points and Shrewsbury got second with 84 and Cheltenham Town got third with 76 points and this is how the FA Cup ended we did get eliminated in the semis versus Chelsea who won 1-0 and they went on to win the final versus Arsenal 2-1 Manchester United won 3-1 in the final versus QPR and that was a very deserved win and it does look like Manchester United win a trophy this year. And now we have the J Payne trophy. We lost in penalties 5-3 to three, and it was a 1-1 draw but we went to extra time. We couldn't score any more goals and we went to penalties and Bristol City won the J Payne trophy. So those are all the competitions and it does look like Portsmouth are going to go on to the Football League 1 with us. They won the League 2 playoff and they beat the other team I don't know what team that is but they won 1-0 and Portsmouth are going on to the next division but that's pretty much it we're gonna end the season now and then we're gonna see if we get any more messages and then we're gonna see the squad report and see the squad we have and how the players grew so overall the board was very happy with our performance this season we did very well in the domestic cup they were very happy and they said that we had a super season and now we're gonna go on to the football league one and that is when things get very freaking good I can't believe that we made it to the football league one we started off shaky but we made it to another division and this is when things get good now we made it to the squad report we're going to try to go as fast as possible through these but we're going to start things off with our goalkeeper anton mitryushkin who in 58 appearances he had 28 clean sheets and he did go up to a 66. He ended off the season with a 66 overall rating. He sucks at Wakambu, 65 rated. He got two assists, which is pretty good for a fullback. Anderson is a 67 overall rated center back. Antonio Briseño is 66 rated, and he got one goal in 51 appearances. Yusuf Corne is 61 rated. We have Beagle with a 68 rated center defensive mid, 19 years of age. In 38 appearances, he had three goals and three assists. Now we move on to Godfred Donsa who has the closest rating to a 70. He's a 69 rated center mid, 19 years old, and he's valued at $1 million. Three goals, three assists this season. We also have Fares Baluli, who we got in the January transfer window. He ended off the season with one goal and one assist, 67 rated. Turdirk is 67 rated. Overall, our best player of the season with 17 goals and 10 assists. This guy was insane. I love him to bits and he's freaking awesome. And we have Carlos Strandberg who went up to a 67. I thought he wasn't going to grow, but he did grow. And in 40 appearances, he got 18 goals and 3 assists. So he did pretty good as our striker. We have Diego Fangundes who really didn't do a lot this season. But the stats that he did get say something completely different. Getting 15 goals and 7 assists. 68 rated. Freaking awesome. Tim Dearson who was one of our best players starting off the season. 
Later on, he didn't do that good, but he was still an important player. 65 rated cam, 7 goals, 6 assists. Danny Whitehead went up to a 60. And we have Alexander Boljevic with a 66 rating, 3 goals, and 1 assist. And we're just going to go quickly through these. I'm just going to show you guys that we got Ty Browning up to a 65. And any other great players, there's no one else that did grow. We do have Lloyd Jones, who started off with a 58, I think. But this is everyone else. And uh, yeah, this is how we ended off the season. Very impressive, I must say. I'm very happy with our squad, and uh, yeah, that is how we ended off the season, and now we're going to get into the January transfer window, but that's going to be in the next episode, which is going to be season 2, episode 1. Make sure not to miss that. Leave a comment down below of other players I can get this transfer window. I'm going to show you guys our, our transfer budget right now. Right now, we do have $825,000, but once we sell Bruna... We are going to be able to get more money this season. So hopefully we do get more money with the board. Uh, but that is pretty much it. I hope you guys did enjoy the video. I'm sorry that we couldn't go through the top scores. I think we... Never mind. We can go through it right now. So before we end the episode, the top score was Collins with 24 goals. The closest one we had was Fangundes with 14 goals. So he started scoring a lot of goals in the league. We have Richards with 10 assists in the league. And we have our closest player is Dirk with 9 assists. So he was 1 assist away from 1st place. And we also have Mityushkin winning with an outstanding 25 clean sheets this season. And overall he did very good as our goalkeeper. Very impressed by him. But this is the end of the video. If you guys did enjoy it, leave a like, comment down below and subscribe. But this was a little short. I didn't want to make it too long. So this is the end of the video. Leave a comment down below. I'm Quinkin. And I'll see you guys next time. I will come home.